Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be what's in my diaper bag. I have two little girls. One just has turned three on a Christmas Eve and the other one just turned 10 months this weekend. So I wanna show you what I have in my diaper bag and there's a funny story behind this diaper bag. Um, I've gone through, I think, three different diaper bags. One was for my first daughter when I only had her. That bag was a little too small for um, having two children, so what I did is I decided to buy a book bag type diaper bag, and it worked out well. However, I went kind of the cheaper route and I bought one on Amazon, and the pockets on the inside basically came unraveled. So I decided, okay, it's time for another one. So my baby was, I want to say six or seven months old, maybe? maybe eight months old and I went to Burlington to go Christmas shopping and I saw this diaper bag and it was marked I want to say about $45 and I thought no way I can't spend that much money on a diaper bag I don't know maybe that's um, very little money but to me that was a lot so I just basically said I love the bag but I can't spend that much money so we went back to Burlington to do a little bit more Christmas shopping and I just, you know, went back to the diaper bag section and looked at this bag in particular again and it was marked down from 45 to 35 and I was like, oh, maybe, but it's still too much. So I just skipped, skipped it again that day. Then about a week before Christmas, we were doing some more shopping at that same store and I went back, this, this time my husband was with me and the two girls were with me. And we went back for some really quick Christmas items and I went and looked at the bag a third time and it was marked down to $14.99. Oh my gosh, the glee on my face, my husband said was just priceless. So needless to say, I bought the bag and I wanna show you what's inside today. Just keep watching. If you're new, please hit that red subscribe button. I would love to have you. Thank you for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoy videos like these. To start off, I have up here this little clip that has little rubber bands on it for my three-year-old. We basically always lose rubber bands. I'm sure some of you can relate. So I keep that here so that I can have one handy for her hair. On the small zipper part are my quick grab and go things that I often need. Chapstick for my baby. I have two pacifiers. Kind of when we were driving and I need to, maybe she's unhappy and these really help if I need to find her passy really quick. Actually, it's three of those. And actually, I have two chapsticks and two lipsticks from whenever I wore these last. Um, so I just threw them in there, obviously. obviously. So this is a Marc Jacobs and this is an Ulta lipstick and then two chapsticks and three passies are in this small pocket. So moving on to the bigger section, there's lots of different things in here. So I will actually show you a clip of all that's in here and then I'll go through with it one at a time to show you what what it is that I'm holding. So first you're gonna see oh, this um, changing pad comes with it. Nice open changing pad. This would have been great to have when my baby was a newborn, but she's a little older now and we change her quickly like in the car, but that's about it. She doesn't really get a diaper change as often as newborns do, but this would have come in handy for, the, for that uh, age. And then I have a bag of wipes in this larger pocket. I have a, a little phone toy for her. And then moving on is this wonderful, wonderful grab uh, pocket, this grab pocket purse. And inside is just basically my wallet. So. I like this because there's days that my husband will get home and I just need to run to the grocery store. I don't want to carry this, but I just need my wallet. 
So I will just grab this and put my phone inside and my keys and I'm ready to go. Then I have basically all of my three-year-old snacks and um, my baby's pouches. So these are my three-year-old snacks, a little pack of little cookies, some puffs, a uh, little banana apple pouch for my three-year-old, and then this is for my 10-month-old. This is a banana apple apricot with rice, baby food puree. And then moving on, I also have some formula. This container was from the Dollar Tree. I have some formula. I am a breastfeeding mama, but for some reason, I dry up pretty significantly around the nine month mark. And so we've been having to supplement uh, with um, some formula. Um, I'm definitely all for the breastfeeding, but my personal body doesn't produce as much around the nine month mark and they of course need to be fed more after, as they get older. So we had to switch to a formula. I use Gerber uh, Soothe formula. I love that formula. It's like the only formula that doesn't have that heavy metal smell. So I like that formula. Then I have some makeup pouches, makeup uh, cases really, that have some lipsticks and lip balms in there. I just kind of keep some makeup. I don't keep a whole lot of makeup, but just lip products because those wear off if you're eating out, drinking coffee, things like that. I don't keep other makeup in here, just my lip products. Then I have a pouch that had some nursing pads in it and a little brush for my three-year-old in case I need to brush her hair for some reason. So I might actually take these out. I don't need these as much now because I am a little less I produce a lot less now so I don't need those as much then on the very bottom I keep the diapers and the change of clothes so what I, I have a rule that no matter where I'm going I need to make sure that I have two to three diapers for each um, kid now my three-year-old is being potty trained she does very well um, for number two she never goes in her pull-up but we're still working on um, going pee pee in the potty. Um, she does it, I would say 50% of the time. So we're still working on that. So she does have pull ups in here. So I keep about three, or I'm sorry, I have two of them actually right now. So I keep two or three of these and two or three of my, um, my baby's diapers. This is actually a pull up, this is just a different brand. So three pull ups and two diapers. I would recommend though, three diapers for babies, two pull ups for those toddlers. Then I have a change of clothes. Typically I have a onesie for my baby and a, pant, uh, a pair of pants and a shirt for my toddler. So this is the onesie for my baby and then a pair of pants. I don't have a shirt in here which I'm glad I did this because we, we do need a shirt sometimes. Sometimes she spills pouches on her or um, her water so she'll get wet, especially in the winter time. I want to be able to change her clothes so she doesn't get cold. So I have that and last but not least is this little, oops, this little zipper pouch inside and I keep a pair of gloves and a pair of socks. Socks are for my baby and the gloves are for my toddler since it's winter time. And I carry this little container of rice cereal. Um, sometimes my baby will eat the rice cereal with the pouch mixed, but if I think she might need a little bit more food to kind of hold her over until we get home, I like to put this inside her uh, milk bottle. It breaks down fine, fine enough to where it goes through the nipple. So this um, is really good to have just because I might need it. Um, this is a secret stash of um, gummies, fruit snacks for my three-year-old. I keep these only to treat her if she's being a good girl in the car or in a restaurant. I like to have these because I wanna reinforce good behavior. So when she's acting wonderfully at a restaurant, which is becoming better, um, I like to reward these in the car when we go home, just so she knows that I was really proud of her. So I have those secretly. <laughs> and then I have a, um, 
a teething toy for my uh, baby because she's teething of course she's uh, 10 months old and then I have this wonderful hand sanitizer um, it's Dr. Bronner, Bronner's organic hand sanitizer it's a spray so I highly recommend this especially right now flu season cold season this has saved us many many um, hardships during the weeks when I know family members or friends are cold and they're really close by and I wipe their hand I wipe my kids hands and I spray this on their hands as well and then I also have a paint sample of the bedroom paint that we're doing um, I'm gonna have a video on that soon I did a before shot yesterday and I'm going to film what the paint color looks like right now on the wall it is this color and I really like it and then the next step is um, painting all of the molding white which will happen tomorrow so I'm gonna have a video up of like a great reveal um, next week hopefully depending on if the painting goes as well and or goes well and goes as planned we will have a video on that so that's everything in my diaper bag I'm pretty sure so it's a very large diaper bag it has a, ba a big insert right here where I put all the other stuff in there and then a zipper pouch the zipper pouch right here so it seals it I can put things in there a big pouch on the opposite side let me see if you can see a big pouch on the opposite side and it has these stretchy pockets on the inside where I put their snacks and then I love this these are the um, handles that you use on the stroller on my stroller I have velcro clips that look like hooks like this and these just basically hook on and I can reach in my purse with the diaper bag if I need anything while we're out food if I need to pay for something stuff like that very 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 handy so also I have these pockets on either side one on this side one on this side and I put my toddler's water bottle or water cup sippy cup in this or my baby's uh, formula bottle in these these are very very handy to cr to grab quickly um, my three-year-old now of course just grabs it out of there if she's thirsty if she's like I don't know running around somewhere and we have this bag out she'll just grab it and use it so this is really 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 handy that's what's in my diaper bag. Thank you for watching. If you're new, please hit that red subscribe button and click that notification bell so you don't miss another video from me. Thank you for watching again, and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Bye.